In this calibration, we will be calibrating pressure sensors, electrical pressure sensors with an output of 4 to 20 milliamps operating in your typical current loop setup. The pressure sensors are off to the right. There's two of them. We're only going to be calibrating one of them in this example. But the output is being read by the Fluke 8846A digital multimeter and we have a, a benchtop grade power supply providing the current loop and the reference pressure is coming from the Fluke calibration model PPC4. In the compass world, to do this calibration we first have to create device and test definitions. We have to create a device definition for every piece of hardware that will be used in the calibration and we have to create a test definition that tells the program how the calibration is going to be performed. Once these definitions are created, then we can run a calibration. So in this overview, we have two pressure sensors. However, we only have a single channel digital multimeter. Therefore, I'm going to calibrate one sensor at a time. Compass can handle multiple sensors. And if this were, were desired, then the multimeter would be replaced by a a multimeter that combines a multiplexer where it can scan multiple channels at a time. Uh, the power supply, the multimeter, and the PPC4 are treated in the compass world as support devices. They are required to support the calibration of the pressure sensor. The pressure sensor is categorized as a device under test, a DUT. So the following videos will look at how to set up a support device definition for a PPC4, the digital multimeter. It'll look at how to create a DUT definition for the pressure sensors, a test definition, and then finally showing the whole calibration operating.